Lil Migo had a crazy altercation. I don't even want to call it an altercation, man. That was just <laughs> a Grove Hero walked up on him, had the phone on him, told him to come outside and 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 and, and slapped him. Yeah, I seen that shit. I mean, folks need to get security. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Cause um I think Lil Migo, um, he not that big of a guy. So I mean, I feel like a lot of people will try him because, like, at the same time, remember when me and, me and you was talking, and I was telling you that everybody tough, you know what I mean? But they they can't be tough in jail, and they can't be tough in in them airports. Anywhere where you can't have your gun, you gotta know how to like, you know what I'm saying? You gotta have that side. You gotta know how to fight. I be doing boxing class. I go to the gym two three times a day. You know what I mean? I run. I do. I, I'm. I'm all prepare myself for like some weird shit. You know what I'm saying all the time. But I just feel like bro needs security though. That's all. Cause I just seen the incident you posted yesterday about uh some nigga taking his chain. Man, I'm like damn. Yeah. Like back to back. That shit. I, that should be sad to me, man. You know what I'm saying? Cause I. I was like, how did that happen? And then you know how 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 we is. As blacks, we we want to do the we want to we want to go over and beyond type shit. So it was fun. It was kind of funny as hell when Charleston was like, "I'm I'm a." He said, "You know what I do, little amigo? He is like, "I dial nine one one immediately." <laughs> I say this nigga is funny as hell, <laughs> but it's like at the same time, it's it's like, it's like damn though, bro. Like, fuck, man. That 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 jury shit and that is I hope it's like I hope you had insurance. Um it just it is it could be a sign of saying like, man, hey bro, it's time to get security. Cause it can get luckily, you know, a person they kill. You know what I'm saying? It could cause it could have been it could have been a win another way. A person could have not took the chain, they could have just said, you know what, let me pop them. All that money, why are you still in Chicago? why are you still in Memphis? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, but you gotta you you gotta realize this. Everybody want to feel like they're around their people, and it could be your own people. You know what I mean? Some sometimes, um, your trackers are real. The spy stores are real. You know what I mean? So, um, you could be staying somewhere and you thinking you safe, and they got a whole spy camera on your crib. They got a whole tracker. A uh, hidden tracker on your car, or on your baby mama car, or on your grandma car. You know what I mean. All this stuff is really real, like so. You have to be careful at all times when it comes to the way you move and how you move. And sometimes people be feeling like, man, shit, this is where I'm from. Ain't no nigga finna run me out my city. It could be that. Mm. It's, it's it's attitudes, but God will show you that you know, give you signs. Sometimes you got to pay attention to the signs. The airport was the first sign. I would have to have to get security to, for anything else. Mm -hmm. Now, you, now, I just look at it like, man, I don't know. You just gotta play this shit right, bro. 